Alright everyone, today we're going to be going over something else in patch 26.1, and that's Garuda's rework. She got a nice little shadow rework. We're going to go in here and take a look at her. So first thing first, what was in her rework is pretty straightforward and pretty simple. She got some fixes to her animations. That's kind of nice. She got a little bit faster in her casting. Bloodletting is now faster. Real minor change. Bloodletting also got a fat buff, and that's almost a. F it went from 25 to 35 percent on how much energy it gives you back. You might go, that sounds like nothing. Except it's a base. That is a 30% base efficiency increase on the ability that gives you energy. This is just like, here, have just like a streamline on this ability for free. No biggie. And things can get really stupid when you involve fleeting expertise. Yeah, that's 140% energy. That means that that's, it's stupid. I mean, holy crap. Let's take a look. Let's drain all of our energy. We'll just get some of this out. You might notice This isn't do, doing too terribly bad. And this is modless. Alright, there we go. We're out of energy. And then Earth 4 also allows 4 slash. It's nice. So now we're at 31 energy. Press R3 once. Yeah. Yeah, that's full. That's a full energy thing. Let's get really absurd with it. I mean, just full energy. That's, why? Why? Why would you do this? <laughs> also, it doesn't seem to affect it. You can go down a little bit farther. That's... Hmm... I don't have another one. I do not think you need both. In fact, I would kind of take the fleeting expertise and just dump it. I don't think you really need that. But you know what I'm thinking. We gotta see it. We have to see if this works. We have to. I don't have a choice. We're going to use the same group of fodder. And yes, this animation is faster now. Yeah, it's still slow as a turtle. I, I don't even know why they don't make it faster than this, but... There we go. So, bloodletting. Oh, fuck. Gosh, do you see that? It's 600 in one go? What? Guys. This is awesome. This is absurd, though. I mean, I don't know why. <sighs> why? I mean, thanks? But, wow. So, I'm going to jump over into my normal build. Um... Yeah, I mean, I still don't even know. This is a test build. Don't get too excited. There's some weird things going on. <laughs> weird things. Um, actually, I'm missing a mod. Yep, I'm missing something I do want. And yeah, you can see what I'm going for. Casting time. Um, we're going to slap it on... Yeah, I don't want to put it there, but I don't think I have a choice right now for this testing. 
Um, we're at full health. Nice that we keep, still have the bleed effect going on on the body. Beautiful. So, guys, that's only that's only streamline. That's three hundred energy off of streamline. I don't need that much. Like I genuinely don't need that much. Holy crap. <laughs> I mean, I what am I gonna do with it? That's too much. Then you heal a little bit. Guys, energize doesn't work that fast. Honestly, I don't notice a huge difference. You guys can probably tell me better than I can see. But this is not a bad deal. The Force Slash is helping. And this is Zaw with 10% status. You guys have seen it before. But. Man. Garuda is good now. Like, this is a substantial improvement to her. A very substantial improvement to her overall kit. And just with some small little tweaks. I'm very happy with where she is. I, I think she could be better. This, like, she needs something for durability. Her augment is the dumbest garbage I've ever seen. Like, let's try her augment. Let's try Dreadmere. You're going to see some stupid things. Yeah, that, that's all it did. Let's... Well, that changed. That changed. You're not... Hmm. That's changed. That has changed. I'm going to have to do more testing, but Dreadmere has, may have gotten very, very, very good. I'll see you guys soon.